we're going to see how to implement banner ad so let's get started the first thing that you need to do is download this unity package i will put the url in the description when it's downloaded just double click on it so that it can open in your project import everything now make sure your build setting platform android or ios now create a c sharp script i'm gonna name it add script let's apply this script on our scene i'm gonna create an mpt game object name it script drag and drop this script on it Double click add a script to open in Visual Studio. Now I'm going to paste my code over here. Just import the required package. Just like that. If you can see, this is the simple code. I want to point out one thing when you are testing uh, your ad in your device, use this line of code. When you are submitting your app for production, comment this and uncomment this and use this line of code. As we are testing right now, you're going to use this line of code. Just call this method in your start method. I'm going to put the download link of this script file in the description so that you can download. Now let's test our application build and run when you build your application you may see this error what this error mean is the google sdk requires a higher level of android we can easily remove this error by going to edit project settings player and over here as you can see my minimum api level is 2.3.1 i'm gonna set it to 4.0 ice cream sandwich and start the application again as you can see my ad is showing so this is the simple way how you can show banner ad in unity we will implement full screen ads that is interstitial ads so let's get started first of all i need to download the google mobile ads unity plugin now i'm going to open it in my unity going to import everything first i'm going to create a script i'm going to name it game script and we'll open it in visual studio I'm going to paste my code over here. This is the simple code. What this code do is after two seconds, it going to initialize is game over boolean to true and will print game over in console. Nothing else simple. Now apply this script in your scene. Just drag and drop it over here. Now let's test it out. As you can see, after three seconds, it printed this message in the console and set this game over, which is a static boolean to true. Now create another script, name it add script, open in Visual Studio. I'm going to paste the code in this script. Don't worry, I'm going to put the download link of this script in the description so that you can download. This script is fairly simple. First, it's calling this method. In this method, I'm requesting interstitial ads. And one thing I need to point out is when you are testing your application, use this line of code and comment this. But when you are uploading your application to production, comment this line of code and use this. 
and in the update method as you can see my script is checking is game is over which I am getting from here my game will over after 2 seconds in update my script is checking if the game is over after 3 seconds it going to show the ad simple is that nothing fancy let's go back to unity add this script on the scene let's build our application build and run when you build the application you may see this error what this error is saying you need a higher api level for android let's remove this error go to edit project settings player and over here select the higher sdk i'm going to select ice cream sandwich now run it again So after 3 seconds our ad should be displayed in the device. As you can see my ad is displaying. So this is the simple example how you can show full screen interstitial ads in Unity.